Here I am again in Manila just showing you what's going on with my uh, little aquaponics setup. Uh, it's been a couple of weeks since I've planted uh, the plants uh, from my last video, you'll probably remember. Everything seems to be going really well. Um, the tomato plants are going um, pretty good actually. Um, four or five inches tall. Uh, I've, I've picked some of the, the weedy, littler ones um, and give the bigger ones a bit more room to grow. Uh, the lettuce is not as going as well as I would have hoped. Uh, the wind seems to be um, making it flutter around a bit and sometimes it, it falls over and I have to pump them up again with, with a few stones but but overall I'm pretty happy with, with that amount of, of, of growth that I've got going in, in the system. Um, bell siphon in there and the gravel guard. Bell siphon cuts off and, and kicks in 100% of the time now and it's really good. I'm really happy with, with how the system has been um, operating. And if you can hear that, you can probably hear the bell siphon um, gurgling, trying to cut off. Put that lid back on and without hurting the little tomato plant. Uh, I've got quite a few fish now. Um, I've only got quite a few more. So I'll let you have a look in there. Just goldfish at this stage. A um, couple of couple of bigger ones. Now I'm leaving the um, pump on 100% of the time. The air pump that is, uh, which is situated in there, um, and, and blowing bubbles over there just all the time. Just to make sure that water's aerated enough because the, the fish seem to be coming to the top a bit. Uh, as well as the, the water pump um, aerating the uh, the water. So I did have, I bought three tilapia and put them in and they, they hung out at the bottom. Um, unfortunately though the next day I came out and, and two of them had died and, and the, the third one died a few hours after so not exactly sure why. Uh, Maybe the goldfish are just a bit more resilient. Um, I haven't been testing the, p the pH or, or anything like that, so I'm not really sure of the acidity of the water. Uh, but that's that's next on my list of things to do. Um, so that's basically the update at this stage uh, of my aquaponics setup. Um, I've got bell peppers. That's a that's a bell pepper you're looking at there. Uh, another one over the back bell pepper or um, as we'd say in Australia capsicum capsicum um, and the, the tomato plants there one lettuce uh, another lettuce another lettuce over there so a um, couple more weeks hopefully these will, will, will keep growing and growing and growing and, and um, produce some fruit I'll have to research it a bit more to see what time of year and etc uh, when the tomatoes do actually produce the fruit because obviously it's outside system and hasn't got that artificial light where you can manipulate the uh, the hours of the day. I've got quite a bit of um, green algae um, on the, the clear tubs out here uh, that face the sun. Not overly worried about that. Uh, I put some of the, the smaller pebbles um, initially into the gravel just to um, plant the, the plants into. To, to give it a bit more, more uh, holding power or staying power. Uh, but to be honest, the gravel seems to be a bit more, um, the plants in the gravel seem to be going a bit bigger than the actual ones in, in, the, in the pebbles and the uh, uh, crushed coral. So only time will tell. Maybe they're getting a bit more light. Because um, they, they only seem to be getting three, four, five hours of direct sunlight a day. Um, before the uh, the neighbouring buildings actually block it off. Maybe I'm looking at getting uh, another setup out on the front veranda, which uh, will get a lot more sunlight and hopefully a lot more growth. But that's basically it at this stage, guys. Um, thanks for checking in and, and seeing what's happening with with my latest update. Um, but everything seems to be going really well. Um, the water's quite clean. I haven't cleaned the water once, um, but it's it seems to be getting filtered by the by the plants up here. So the whole system seems to be going according to plan.
Okay. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Bye.